episode of Reviews on the Tomb, I will be reviewing the 65134 Sabrina's Costume Shop. Now, this costume shop was released this year, 20, in 2016, at Michael's. And this was, in fact, my first Max Spooky Town building for this year. And honestly, it is a really cool one. Um, that nice packaging. Um, got the piece in the middle, which we'll take a look at in a little bit. But actually, right now, we're going to be taking a look at Sabrina's Costume Shop. So starting out the detail on the Sabrina's Costume Shop, we are going to be taking a look at the ground, which has some very cool things added to it. So I got some pumpkins, actually jack-o'-lanterns with three skull heads near there. And kind of towards the middle, you got a skeleton wearing a top hat sitting in his coffin. That's really cool. I like that a lot. And over on the other side, you can see it says, Customize your tombstone. Which, there we go. It says, Customize your tombstone. Um, a sign there, and then you got some tombstones back there. So, yeah, and you also got some tools on the side there as well. So you got a chainsaw, looks to be an axe, and a sword. So as you can see, um, you can see a little window. Yeah, there's my hand the reflection there. Um, with some costumes on display. So you got a mummy, and it looks to be a zombie next to it. And then you got some nice little like webbing on the uh, corners of the pillars and you got the doorway there with a little vac of just accessories I think oh yeah and you also got a little lamp there too and then moving over here you got some um, teeth like werewolf teeth vampire teeth and a sign that says wacky teeth sale so that so Sabrina's having a sale on some teeth. And kind of the roof area which says costumes a little sign and there's also a little sign right there on the side of the building that says Sabrina's costume shop um and then you got like a little curtain thing that covers the window with some leaves on it and you got a uh, little mirror thing with a skull printed on it. Here's the main, main roof of the Sabrina's Costume Shop. And as you can see, you got a witch, uh, which is supposed to act like the weathercock up there. You know, tell where the wind's blowing. And then you got a skull, and then you got two bats on the side of the, of the roof, the main roof. Then you got a chimney. You got some little fencing, got some windows up there. And you have Sabrina's. And in here, there's actually some mass. You can see a little bit through the window. You can see the camera right now. But I'll turn it on a little bit. So you can see that a little bit clearer. And now I think that's really it for the detail of the Sabrina's Costume Shop. And let's go ahead with the conclusion. Here's just a quick look at the bottom of the costume shop. And why I'm showing you this is some really nice um, feature they added onto this is that that hole is for the light bulb. Usually in Lemax pieces they put the, that hole in the back of the building and yeah that really just doesn't look too nice when they put it in the back of the building. So I, I'm very glad that Lemax decided for this building to put it in the bottom of the piece to make it to make it not so ugly in the back with that hole and the light. Here's what Sabrina's costume shop looks like all lit up when you insert the light cord in and plug it into an outlet. It just looks very, very cool. Gives it a very, very nice effect to this costume shop and honestly makes it, uh, makes it look pretty cool. Um, so yeah, then now you can see the windows a little bit better. Um, when I was shining my big lamp on it. But anyways, let's get on to the completion of this review right now. 
So this is going to be my conclusion on the Remax Piggy Town 2016 item number 65134, Sabrina's Costume Shop. First of all, before I start this conclusion, I want to say a big thank you to Jaden from Jaden's Videos for making this review happen because I don't really review lighting pieces. I'm more towards the animated and the bigger sight and sound pieces when I do these spooky tone reviews. So I want to say thank you, Jaden, for um, making this review happen, basically. So, with that being said, um, the Sabrina's Costume Shop is, in fact, a really cool piece. I don't think I saw the price, so you can pick this up at your local Michaels for $55, but you can also use a 50% off coupon to get this for cheaper, a much cheaper price. So, um, this building is very, really cool. I kind of like, I mean, I like the, I like the design of it. Um, it has some very cool parts to it, like I really enjoy the, the mass display, um, yeah, the mass display up on the top, above the costume sign. Uh, I really, I really like that skeleton coming out of the, or sitting on the coffin in the front. That's in front of the costume display in the window. And, yeah, the only downside I have with it though, because if you notice, if you look back at, uh, ah, oh, jeez, I forgot the year, so I'm just gonna guess, 2006 or 2007, costume shop it is the exact same building just with different colors I believe the the way like the white is that was like green and the there was no like or yellow light it was like a purple ish so that's one thing I don't I kind of don't like about this is that they just use the exact same building but just added made it into a different color put some stuff that they didn't put in the last one. So I don't know. I mean, I like it and I don't like it that they just got lazy and used um, a, a past um, sculpture and just painted it. I don't know. I mean, I mean, it still looks cool, but I would have liked uh, like a little bit different design rather than just having the same building just having it repainted basically so yeah that's the only negative thing about it but other than that this building is really really cool um so yeah this can go great in any Lemax spooky town town setting that you are trying to put together and and the other thing I've been really like about it is that this piece isn't very big. It's kind of like the smallest piece released this year. So if you don't have any room and you really want to get a new piece, I'd go with this one because for being a lighted building, it's it's actually not very wide. It is kind of tall a little bit, but wide, it's actually not very big. Or not very long, I should say. So that's so that's one thing I like about it, is that it's small, it's, it can fit anywhere, even if you have a small space and you want to fill it up, you can put this in there if you don't have any cost, if you don't already have a costume shop. So yeah, I'm just going to cut it there before I keep on rambling and forgetting how much time I have. So anyways, on the reviews from the two rating scale, I will be giving the Sabrina's costume shop from Remax Spooky Town a total of... 3.5 pumpkins. Yes, I think the the design is good. It's just it's just they copied the 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 building structure of the older Cosmo shop. So yeah. So anyway, I really hope you enjoyed this review. Thank you, Jaden, for helping me decide to do this review. Or I probably wouldn't even have done this review. So, I want to thank you, Jaden, for that, buddy. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye, guys.